lovely people welcome back to my channel this is Georgina if you are new to my channel welcome please consider subscribing and clicking on that notification bell so you don't miss any of my delicious recipes and if you are already a member thanks for subscribing in today's video I'll be sharing with you how to make no bake Oreo cheesecake let's go through the ingredients and let's get started you're gonna need 10 grams of gelatin 100 grams of melted butter this is the cream that I took from the Oreo cookies. Fresh lemon juice. 4 tablespoons of milk. 250 grams of mascarpone cheese. 300 grams of Oreo cookies. 300 grams of whipped cream. 250 grams of fresh cream cheese. And 300 grams of salted caramel sauce. Let's get started. This is a 10 inch baking pan that I've lined with parchment paper. Set this aside. Soften the gelatin in some water for about 10 minutes. Now put the cookies in your food processor. If you don't have food processor machine, you can just put it in a plastic bag and then crush it. Cover it and pause it for some few minutes. To that I'm going to add in the melted butter. And then pause it again. Remove it and pour it in your baking pan. With the help of your spatula, spread it towards the edge of the pan. Just like how I'm doing it. Just like so. After you are done, put it in the fridge to set for about 30 minutes. Now, add the whipped cream in a bowl and whip it. Whip until it's firm. Now add in the cream from the cookies, the mascarpone, the mascarpone cheese, and the fresh cream cheese. And one tablespoon of lemon juice. Mix everything together. Now bring the milk to a boil and add in the gelatin the milk has boiled now add in the gelatin and then whisk until it melts after the gelatin has melted add it to the cream filling and mix together I'm going to add about 50 grams of Oreo cookies in the cream and then mix it together. It gives um, some crunchiness to it too. At this point, the crust is ready. Now let's add in the cream. Don't put all at once. Put half at put half. Level it and then put the rest. Just like so. And then level it. After you are done, 
Put it in the fridge to set from four to six hours. Overnight is even better. So guys, it's been about six hours and a cheesecake has set. So now let's remove the parchment paper from it. Now put it on your serving tray. This is my homemade salted caramel sauce. If you want to know how to do it, the link will be shown on the description box below. So let's whip it and then use it to decorate on top of the cheesecake. Now let's decorate on top of the cheesecake with the caramel sauce. So you push, then you leave it. Push. Just like so. After you are done, decorate the space left with Oreo cookies, just like so. So guys, I'm done here. Isn't this amazing? If you enjoyed this video and you want to learn something more on my channel, make sure you give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks for watching once again. See you in my next video. Till then, bye bye.